thousands of car crash cases. We will give you the support you need and help to get the best result the possible. Barnes, Burn, injury attorneys, call one 800 million Good morning with Bocalax. Good, good, good morning. Try Dolcolax Chewy Fruit Bites for fast and gentle constipation relief in as little as 30 minutes. Making your good morning even better with Dolcolax. I got hurt in a car accident. Give me one good reason why I should call the Law Brothers. How about three great reasons you should call us? One, we make it easy. We'll deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. Two, there's no upfront cost. You don't owe us a dime unless we win your case. Three, the results. We've helped thousands of people get great settlements. I called the Law Brothers after my accident and they got me two. $2.25 million. We're the Law Brothers. Call 1 800 222 2222. KCAL celebrates pride. Right now at 7 o'clock, four people killed in four shootings, all within 24 hours. We're live in Lancaster as investigators look into whether the string of violence is related. A deadly crash shutting down a part of the 5 freeway. Mark Liu has the details from the desk, while Kalina Strinos is going to help us get through the morning commute. And the first presidential debate of the 2024 election is just hours away. What you can expect when President Joe Biden and former President Donald Trump take the stage for a rematch. is KCAL News Mornings. Good morning. Today is Thursday, June 27th. I'm Jamie Ukas. And I'm Sheba Turk in for Ruta Bay Shabazi. Thanks for waking up with us here on KCAL News Mornings and streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. Meteorologist Paul Deano joining us now with a look at our next weather forecast. This heat has been great and look at the sunshine this morning. The heat, the sunshine, it is summer and it's going to continue to feel like it today. A little cooler than yesterday, but still really nice. It, it, it's been an awesome stretch of weather. The peak of the heat, that's a couple days behind us. There's more heat to come. But today, temperatures will be very close to average. Uh, here are your temperatures relative to where we were yesterday. We're almost exactly where we were yesterday. Simi Valley, one degree cooler. Claremont, one degree cooler. Wrightwood, two degrees cooler. But Palmdale is one degree warmer. So if you enjoyed yesterday morning, I think you're going to enjoy today. Closer to average today. We do have some cloud cover. It is coastal sections of Orange County waking up to clouds this morning. Otherwise, sunshine and in the OC. And for all of us, we'll have sunshine this afternoon. It is going to get hotter again this weekend and low valley back above 100 degrees we're looking at inland empire well into the 90s so if you don't like it hot enjoy today chino 85 degrees at one o'clock 87 degrees at four o'clock sunshine across the board la cools down to 80 that'll be the coolest day we've had in about a week down to 80 degrees which is exactly average 73 at our beaches 93 for the inland empire and the high desert you are not hit 100 today. You're high today, 97 degrees. We'll talk about that weekend warm up. Right now, let's talk some traffic with Kalina. Good morning. Hi, good morning. I do have a motorcycle crash to tell you about on the 5 freeway. And we have traffic in both directions of the 5 this morning. North and south, and into and out of downtown. So let's get to our maps. You can see what I'm talking about. Right lane is blocked off just before 4th Street. That is in the southbound direction. And the northbound traffic from Norwalk to the 60, that is a 30-minute ride. We also have a stalled car, 210 West at Grand. The carpool lane is blocked off overall back up here leaving the 57 heading into Pasadena. That is a 43 minute commute. Inland Empire, lots of red already popping up on the map this morning. The 91, we had an incident earlier that's long gone, but from Tyler to the 241, that'll take you 34 minutes. And the 71 now is slowing down southbound from Pine to the 91 there. That's a 31 minute commute. I want to get to this too, because we've been talking about this throughout the morning. We have signs along the roadway in Mission Viejo indicating that up ahead, the five freeway is shut down. This is right at the county line through Camp Pendleton heading into San Diego. So the five at Las Pulgas is where we have this deadly crash with all lanes blocked off. It's impacting now the 15 freeway through Temecula leaving Marietta because a lot of people are taking that to get around this and also or take a highway. But I do want to get out to our assignment desk manager Mark Liu because you have video of what happened. And you've been also digging for more answers on what exactly went wrong in this crash. Yeah, that's exactly right, Kalina. The CHP says as many as two cars and two motorcycles were involved in this 
crash. One of them caught fire, debris over all lanes, and at least one person has died here. Now, we do have some video from the scene. It was shot by a videographer from San Diego in the San Diego area. Some of those firefighters you see there are from the Camp Pendleton Fire Department. They, along with the CHP, responded to the southbound lanes of the five at Las Pulgas and Oceanside at about three this morning. Now, the initial report in the CHP logs but there was a, is that there was a single car stalled in lanes, then